Ladies and gentlemen, it's shocking. It's shocking. But from this, from Bengal, we will now shift the attention and spotlight across the country, from the east to the west, to Badlapur, ladies and gentlemen. A grave incident that has ignited widespread outrage in the Thane district and in the Badlapur area. A reputed school being thrust into the spotlight after two four-year-old nursery students were sexually assaulted because the FIR com confirms on one of the child that her hymen was open. And this has been done by a 23-year-old sweeper, Akshay Shinde, who's been employed at the institution. The shock and anger surrounding this case have led to massive protests, dramatic visuals emerging from Badlapur as thousands of people, Aam Admi, again the middle class, turning out to the street on a call of Badlapur Band. Why? Because the local police again tried to drag their feet on the case and to catch the perpetrators. In a span of 10 days, two incidences occurred. This offender encouraged by the fact that there was not so much of action taken. Now he's behind bars, he's arrested. The principal suspended, a teacher suspended, an attendant suspended. But all of this only when there was public anger. And this call was for a Badlapur Band and people have turned out in large numbers, blocking the movement of trains, calling for a shutdown of the city, cops resorting to lati charge, also using to, to having to use tear gas shells and firing in the air to try and disperse this crowd, which was largely peaceful and turned violent when the police started to use hard action. But they went into that, call, into that school and destroyed that nursery classroom around which this entire incident had happened. Mob belting stones and also throwing bottles at the cops at the station when they tried to resort to lati charge to disperse the crowd. They got angry, then calmed down again. The cops eventually towards the evening had to call on RAPF and the Rapid Action Police Force or the RAF and then they dispersed these crowds towards the end of the uh, day, around about 6 p.m. this evening. They ransacked the properties. This bond given by several organizations to protest against this entire incident. Why? Purely because the authorities tried to drag their feet on the entire case. That senior inspector, a lady herself, has now been transferred. She's been shunted. The CM, Deputy CM, everybody has now spoken. The accused Akshay Shinde arrested after the parents insisted on filing a formal complaint despite initial attempts by the cops to try and play down this entire matter by delaying the filing of the FIR for over 12 hours. Ekna Shinde, the Chief Minister, assuring speedy justice and saying this matter will be not only investigated by an SIT, they've been handed over and tasked to investigate this matter, but also said that it will be fast-tracked in courts. I have said Police Commissioner अब हार्ड एक्शन लेना जरूरी है जो भी गुनागार है उसे कोई भी स्पेयर नहीं करना है वो फास्ट ट्रैक पर केस लेने को मैंने कहा है ये स्पेशल पीपी देने अपॉइंट करने की बात मैंने कही है और जो स्कूल है जो संस्था है उन्होंने भी ऐसे कर्मचारी जो डायरेक्ट लड़कियों को डील करते हैं हैंडल करते हैं उनको उनकी ट्रैक रिकॉर्ड देखना चाहिए उनका बैकग्राउंड देखना चाहिए पूरी तरह जब परखकर ऐसे लोगों को काम पर रखना चाहिए इसलिए संस्था चालकों का भी यह संस्था का भी इंक्वायरी होनी चाहिए उसके ऊपर भी कार्रवाई होनी चाहिए दुर्भाग्यपूर्ण घटना है दुखद घटना है और यह संस्था के चालक जो है उन्होंने परखकर लोगों को लेना चाहिए नाउ लेट्स गेट यू द टाइमलाइन ऑफ द इंसिडेंट 12th ऑफ ऑगस्ट टू 4 ईयर ओल्ड द रिपोर्ट्स सरफेस दैट दे हैव बीन असॉल्टेड सेक्सुअली असॉल्टेड बाय द स्कूल स्वीपर 16th of August, the cops reach the police station for a complaint and an FIR is registered after 12 hours of the complaint being registered because the parents realize that their children don't want to go to school and when they were questioned, they say that they have been touched after being disrobed and then a medical examination suggests and then says that, the girl, that one of the girls had her hymen open, a four-year-old. 19th of August, parents demand action the school principal against the school principal, class teacher and the female attendant, they have been suspended. 20th of August, the accused was arrested, sent to police custody. Local storm Badlapur railway station, agitators vandalized the school. The incident coming to light when one of the girls confided to her grandfather about sexual abuse by the school sweeper and why he would take her and her friend to the washroom and then disrobe them and then insert our huge... Uh, at their private parts, insert his fingers and spread his hands over their private parts. That's when they were done. They, they went there and got a medical examination done. And the FIR quotes that one of the girls had her hymen open. They were afraid to go to school. 
that's why the anger of the middle class of the people saying if our own children are not going to be safe in school then where else will they be safe but these glaring lapses in the case first one the school didn't ensure women staff in the nursery section there was no cctv ca camera there the school it was not working at all fir registered 12 hours after the incident and an attempt to play down this entire effort played down altogether there have been similar molestation cases in the past in maharashtra february 2024 kapurwadi a 27 year old bus attendant arrested for allegedly molesting six girls and two boys during a school picnic 23rd December in Mumbai sign a 35 year old teacher arrested for allegedly molesting a 16 year old class 10 student in school Jan 2015 this was a few years ago in Thane superintendent of a state run boarding school arrested for allegedly molesting 10 girls aged between 12 and 15 for over a month and then of course nearly a decade ago decade and a half ago in Thane a primary school principal arrested for allegedly molesting a 9 year old female student so this has happened again and again Ladies and gentlemen it's the middle class whose anger is coming out and you can witness this ladies and gentlemen why because the middle class bears the brunt of it again and again and again and when it they say enough is enough you see them protesting out on the streets and the middle class gets upset when the system fails to protect their interests the fifth system fails to do its job those tasked with the responsibility of protecting the public refuse to do their job or fail to do their job and institutions organizations schools colleges and workplaces don't provide